Hey guys, Renny here with Off Grid Trek. I just wanted to give an example uh, using Amanda Sweet Van here of some of the customized solutions that we can do. And this is an example of something we can do for you. So as an example, and we're gonna go into the van here a little bit later on. We've got, uh, I'm just using this, we have several different packages and we can create custom packages as well. We're using the Energy Flex here as an example with one of their battery packs. So that's 1,069 watt hours. We've got two of our 215 watt solar blankets, all of the cabling, and we're gonna connect that in series and Amanda is going to show us how we do that uh, in here in the next moment if you don't mind doing that Amanda and by the way this is Amanda <laughs> So yeah, uh, all I wanted to go through here, guys, uh, first and foremost, the, uh, the solar blankets, they're only 13.6 uh, pounds a piece. So they're really not that heavy. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to carry the cables over here for her as well. And what we've done with these, this package is, um, so we've got two of our 215 watt solar blankets that Amanda is laying out here. So she's just laying these out here on the ground. And like I said, quite easy to use. You can see how easily they, they just fold right out. The big bonus to these, obviously if you point them at the sun, you're gonna get a little bit better, uh, a little bit po uh, better power. However, you don't necessarily need have to because of the fact that uh, these ones, these are our 215 watts, they have their efficiency rating is actually 23.5% efficiency rating. Or sorry, let me rephrase that, 23.8. Our 200 watts are 23.5. So that's actually quite impressive with that. Oh, and I'm just gonna show you these here real quick. The way we've labeled our solar cables. So we have three connectors here, and I'm gonna pass this to Amanda in a second. Uh, we have two solar inputs, so we try to keep it as simple as possible for everybody. So those two go right to the solar blankets. And then we have our output. So that's gonna connect either directly to the cable, depending on what solar generator you're using or one of our extension cables. And we're using two extension cables in this demonstration. So here you go, I'll give you this. There's your inputs to make it easy for you. And then we use with ours, we use our, uh, our Anderson SB connectors. That's these big red connectors right there. The bonus to those are you can't reverse polarity. So there's only one way they're gonna physically connect, which is really good. And then of course, here, I'll give you that here. So here's the extension cable, same thing, Anderson SB connector. And by the way, these extension cables, because we use 10 gauge cable, I've used up to four of these together and I've never had to worry about any sort of loss of power or anything with that, which is quite good. Oh, and I'm just gonna show you guys this while Amanda is connecting the next extension cable on the back of all of our solar blankets that we have here, which is pretty cool. We have our quick charge uh, box. Uh, we have two high-speed USB charging ports, USB type C, and I realize I've never really mentioned it. This is USB, or this is a DC port. And I'm just, you're not, you're not really gonna connect a light bulb to it, but I'm just giving you an example. So you can connect DC devices to it, which is actually quite handy as well too. So I'll just get this all out of the way. But uh, let's just go over to Amanda's van here. And so what we've done just for this as an example, we're using two of our extension cords, and then she's using the EC8 cable, which is connecting to the Energy Flex right there and then the, this is just a really good example of you know some of the devices and how you can actually uh connect so yeah give us an idea like it's i know you're an avid hiker you do you do a ton of hiking yeah i know i hike all the time and i use the two-way radios a lot um i use all my phones all my equipment my lights and everything i never have to worry about power um here and then at the end of the day um i have an ice maker if i want it to be super fancy well, yeah, if you want a margarita or something, I guess, after all those hikes. <laughs> but yeah, no, this, this is just a really good example. Like you can see, vans do have a lot of space, a lot of usable space, but it's not like you're in a, you know, a 30 foot regular North American trailer. So you got to make very good use of your space. So the big bonus to how you see this set up, how it is, she still has a little bit of counter space here that can be used. That energy flex or any of the other solar generators that we have, we could easily, we could tuck it away in a corner, put it in a drawer. Uh, it can be used, like I know you have your fridge here, but that's hardwired into your van, but you do have the option of running the fridge. And I think you said you have a diesel heater as well too, that you're gonna run. Yes, I do. I have yeah. a diesel heater and then I'm installing a two-way fan as well that I'm hoping to run off this uh, generator. Okay, yeah, cool. And then the diesel heater, you have the choice because I know you said you're gonna do a dual battery setup. Uh, I know for us, because we're more a little more portable with our setups, we just use a DC plug and we use our diesel heater right off of that. But you have both options, which is kind of cool. Yeah. Great. 
yeah. But yeah, no, just wanted to give everybody an idea here of some of the packages. Uh, you can see how simple it is because I've had a lot of people question about how do you connect in series. Uh, now you can see that the cables are labeled. It makes it quite simple to do and there's no way to reverse polarity. And then the other thing I want to point out real quick, guys, um, and as you saw on the plug there, and it's going to be the same with that as well as the EcoFlow products, um, all of them are pretty much color coded. So our cables where they attach, if you have any questions, just look at the color and just look at the physical size of it. We've made it, we've done our best to make it as simple as possible, just to make it easy for everybody. But I'll do some more videos here in the near future uh, showing we have our 120 watt solar blankets. We can run three off of the Energy Flex, uh, two of our 200 watt solar blankets. I'll do a video on that as well too. And then doing uh, some other videos. It's just uh, finding enough hours in the day. We don't seem to have enough hours in the day anymore, but we'll be doing that as well too. Uh, but yeah, other than that, have a great day, guys. Thank you very much for showing us your sweet van. And I love the woodwork and the cabinetry and everything on this. This is, it's a pretty cool setup. But uh, enjoy your day, guys. By the way, my name's Renny. I'm the owner of the company. Any questions, reach out, shoot me an email, give me a call. I'd be happy to answer your questions. If I don't, if I don't answer the phone right away, we're super busy. Just leave a voicemail and I'll give you a call back as quick as I can. Okay. Have a great day, guys. Thanks, Ed. And thanks again, Amanda. Yeah, no problem. Okay.